but the outdoors is going to be really hot over the next couple of days. Take tomorrow, for instance, yeah. the hundreds. It's nice for us here in the shade, right here and right now, but temperatures are expected to hit the triple digits in the region next week. Amy Nay has more on how to stay cool and, more importantly, how to stay safe in this heat. Here at Liberty Park, many kids are staying cool as the temperatures approach triple digits and experts say staying cool and hydrated will be very important during the summer. Well, the big thing we're concerned about is heat exhaustion. Dr. Joseph Bledsoe is an emergency room physician at Intermountain Medical Center. He says young children and the elderly are at higher risk for heat exhaustion and heat stroke. Oftentimes people have nausea, vomiting, headache, um, you can get flushed skin, a racing heartbeat. Um, rapid breathing, um, and if it progresses onto heat stroke, that's when we start to see mental status changes, confusion, and even coma. Another concern during the summer months, children being left inside cars. Last year, more than a dozen children died in the United States from being left in cars. That's why doctors say parents need to be vigilant. We'll see kids uh, show signs of heat exhaustion within a few minutes of being in the car. So it's really dangerous to leave a young child in the car for any period of time. The best advice to stay cool is to stay inside during the hottest part of the day. If you do go outside, be sure to stay hydrated. If you feel dizzy or nauseous, stop what you're doing and find a place to cool down and be sure to check on the elderly. And we often consider people over the age of 65 to be at a little bit higher risk, but it's probably up into the 70s and 80s that are at the highest risk. I'm Amy Nay for 2 News. Dr. Bledslow did mention the dangers of leaving children inside a hawk car. We should also remind you, never ever leave your pet inside your car as well. And if you see a dog or a child left in a car and it looks like they're unattended, in the hot heat, call 911 immediately. If you'd like more information on heat dangers, go to our website, KUTV.com. Click on the Check Your Health link. We've got some tips there for you as well. All right, we're talking a lot about heat and hot temperatures.